Okay, so this is a review of the first year's jet stroller. This is an umbrella stroller. It's lightweight. It's only 11 pounds, so I really like the uh, compactness and the lightweight um, uh, feature of this stroller. And it's pretty nice for an umbrella stroller. It's got a basket underneath, and it um, has five-point harness, and comes with a canopy. So I'm going to show you all the features of this um, in detail. So the seat, um, this is the green color, I think. Um, and it's kind of this yellowish green color, and I like that. But anyways, the seat is um, not super roomy or anything, but it's um, sufficient. It's very good. And then the uh, it comes with the five-point harness, like I said, which is a really huge plus. I have a seven-month-old baby, and he's still kind of wobbly when he's sitting up, and he doesn't know to not lean over too much when he's sitting in the stroller. So with the three-point harness that don't come with um, doesn't come with those shoulder straps, I feel a little bit, um, you know, unsure about the safety of my baby. So I really like the five-point harness. And um, I did read that um, in some reviews, um, some people are saying that the seat back is not high enough, so um, it's not very comfortable for an older child. Because this uh, stroller does have a weight capacity of 50 pounds, which um, it says here, down there, it, um, it can hold a child up to 50 pounds, which is a pretty high weight capacity for an umbrella stroller. But because the seat back is so short, um, it's not going to be very comfortable for a taller or older child. But so far, my baby's um, fitting in it pretty um, comfortably. His head probably comes up to here or something, so it's pretty good. And let's see. And then the seat has doesn't really have a recline to it much at all. Um, but if you go to the first year's website or you know read any product um, details of this product, it says that it this stroller has a multiple recline position, but it really doesn't, in my opinion, it really doesn't. So um, so this is the upright position right now, and then to recline it, there are two cords with this plastic piece attached, and then if you pull on the plastic part, it reclines. So that's all it does. So it, what it does is really like, um, the seat fabric gets more lax is all it is, so this is a bright position. So as you can see, there's not much of a difference. And especially when there's a child's weight on the seat, then it's going to, um, you know, uh, the seat fabric is going to uh, lag a little bit, any sag a little bit anyways. So I don't really see much of a difference between the upright position and the recline position. But that's okay. Um, it's an umbrella stroller. It's a very simple and very affordable umbrella stroller. I, I actually got this one for, um, I think, like 40 bucks on Amazon. So that is not a deal breaker at all to me. And it does have a basket underneath here. Um, and um, it's not going to hold a whole lot. It's, it can't hold my big diaper bag or anything like that, but it could hold like water bottles and some jacket and maybe like a blanket, um, something like that. And because the seat doesn't recline much, you can have pretty good access back here too. And also I found out that you can actually hang uh, a lot of stuff from the handles, which you're not supposed to, I think, because you know it could be dangerous, it could tip over and stuff. But I, I was able to hang my very heavy diaper back from the handles and it didn't tip over even with anything, um, even without anything or anyone in the stroller. So I was pretty impressed by that. And then it also at the top of um, the stroller up here, there's this nice little parent organizer, it's, um, more storage. And um, it has two cup holders, two small cup holders here and another big um, cup holder or some kind of storage over here. And then there's this uh, pocket in here, in the middle. It doesn't have a zipper or anything, but it um, holds my cell phone, my keys, my wallet and stuff secure, so it's pretty nice. And the other day I was out and it could actually hold three um, soda cups, like, you know, one of those fast food soda cups. One, two, and three in here, so I was pretty impressed. And on the back, there are um, two brakes on the back for the rear brakes. So right now it's in locked position. So you do have to do 
do the lock individually for each wheel. So this right now it's unlocked. So you push down the red lever individually and they're locked. So it's not as easy as one touch brake, but it's not a huge deal to me. And then the front wheels swivel around, so it's pretty nice for um, good maneuverability. But it does not have the ability to lock straight. So um, I think a lot of the strollers nowadays, they come with the ability to lock straight. You know, they have this lever here or something like that. So that would be better for a little bit of a bumpy ride. Um, because it'll, you know, I don't know, right better that way. But this one does not lock straight, so this stroller is going to be only for smooth surface like paved streets and, you know, mall and stuff like that. And it does come with the canopy, which is pretty nice for a uh, an umbrella stroller. However, it's not a very large canopy, as you can see. So it's not going to shade your child very well. So if you um, are taking your baby out in a stroller in a sunny on a sunny day, you probably want to have like an umbrella, a, a blanket uh, in the front, or a canopy extension, like a protect above or ray shade or something like that. And right now it's attached at the highest position, and you can adjust the canopy height by removing. Uh, the canopy and reattaching it. So there are two pieces of Velcro at the back to secure the back. And then this part is just a clip-on. So it comes off really easily and then you can attach it anywhere on the, the frame. So you can attach it like down here or even down here. And I think right now where I usually put it is all the way down here because the baby's pretty short. And then I just attach the back with the Velcro. So this way, it does a little better of a job to shade a shorter child in there. But it's still not going to be enough if the sun's at a wrong, at a wrong angle or something like that. But it is nice that you can adjust the canopy height. And you can fold up the stroller with the canopy attached. So this is that's pretty nice as well. But in order to fold the stroller with the canopy attached, you want to make sure that the canopy is retracted like this. And then I'm going to show you how to fold it up. So there's this little piece, uh, red piece back here on the frame. So you lift it up, and then it's going to fold up. And you can either fold it down to the ground, or what I like to do is just to pick up the front and fold it up. And then there's a manual lock. This red piece is the lock to keep the stroller locked when it's folded. And if you lock the back wheels, you can um, lean it against a wall or something and it's not going to um, roll around, so that's nice. And then you um, to unfold it, you undo the lock, you let the front part fall to the ground, and then push down on this middle bar with your foot and you're ready to go. So that's, I think, all the features of the first year's Jet stroller. Um, I did purchase this as a second stroller, though. I wouldn't recommend this as a first uh, or primary stroller because, um, like I said, it doesn't have any recline position. The canopy is pretty small. Um, you know, the front wheels don't lock. Those are like features that you can live with, live without, but. Um, it's definitely nicer, especially the seat recline, if you want your child to nap in it, or if you have a smaller baby. Um, so, yeah. But I did purchase this one for a, as a second stroller, and for like just quick trips and running errands and stuff like that. So, it's it really does the job for that. And it's really lightweight. You can hold it from this frame back here, and it's only 11 pounds. So. I have no arm muscles whatsoever, but I, it's really easy for me to pick it up and put it in the trunk, out of the trunk, you know, carry it up the stairs. It's no problem. So that's a really nice feature. So I hope it. Uh, I hope this video helps. And this is the first year's jet stroller.